Welcome to part 1 of making a game of Pong. As you may know, Pong was created in 1972 and it is still a very popular game to this day. So in today's video, I'll be showing you guys how to create your own Pong game using Lua and Love2D. Just as the title shows, this will be part 1 of making Pong. There will also be other videos coming out in this channel to complete the whole Pong game. But today I'll only be going over the things that you'll need to create Pong and a screen resolution for Love2D. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed the video. So let's start off with what you'll need to make Pong. So you're going to need to um, install Love2D, Lua, and Visual Studio Code. All of these links will be in the description below and you can download them from there. So basically Love2D is a 2D game development written in C++ and it uses Lua as its language. So basically in Love2D we're going to see our game running. And the second um, is Lua and Lua is going to be the language that we'll be using to create Pong. And Visual Studio Code is basically just our text editor where we write all of our code. So once you've got all these things installed, open up Visual Studio Code and create a new file called main.lua. Once you created a new file called main.lua like this one, you're fir we're first going to um, declare a variable for window width and window height. These, will, um, these are basically going to be our stream resolution for um, Love2D. So it's going to be 1280 by 720 pixels wide. And next here we have a function called love.load. So basically this just starts the game. And basically just starts on um, love2d. And this is this starts the window love.window.setMode. And then we have our window width and window height. This starts the window. And here we dis we made full screen to false and resizable false. So basically here we won't be able to full screen and we won't be able to resize. And here we have vsync equals to true. So basically vsync is um, is your monitor's refresh rate. So if your monitor's refresh rate is 60 hertz, then the game is going to run in 60 hertz. If your monitor refresh rate is 30 hertz, then your game is going to run in 30 hertz. And here we end the function for this. And here we, we may, we're going to make another function called um, love.draw and basically this is used to draw anything on the screen and here we have love.graphics.printf this is basically like a C++ printf where you printf something on the screen but it, here we're printing something onto love2d instead and we're, what we're going to be printing is part 1 of pong so this is just going to be the text showed inside the window and here is um, the starting sp the starting point where we're, this text is going to be so it's basically going to be um, starting at x0. And here we're going to be starting at y. So w our window um, height divided by 2 minus 6. So that's going to become in the middle of the screen. And our window width. So basically the number of pixels to center within. And then we're going to text on, we're going to be aligning it in the center of the screen. And then we also end the function here. So that's basically the code um, to make um, the screen resolution and if we uh, if you press alt and l on your keyboard or you might have a different shortcut love2d will open up and as you can see we can see part one of pong uh, so our window width and window height is 1280 by 720 and we cannot full screen it or resize it and this is going to be my monitor's refresh rate and that's basically if making part one of pong if you guys enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe for future videos. Anyway, see you guys in part 2.